Hello, everyone. I'm Tian a PhD student in Obo University. Today, I'm going to talk about our new work, Indoor Spatial Queries, Modeling, Indexing, and Processing. Recently, indoor location-based services are becoming increasingly popular. Many, spa uh, many space models, index, and algorithms have been proposed. Although these approaches could be used uh, uh, for indoor spatial queries, an experimental study is still missing. In this work, we conduct a, a comprehensive experimental study. We study four typical indoor spatial queries, and we survey five indoor model and uh, indexes. We compare the algorithmic characteristics and their space and time complexities. We also design an in-depth benchmark with real and synthetic data uh, and uh, evaluation tasks and performance metrics. Then we report the results and summarize the pros and cons of all techniques. Firstly, let's talk about uh, indoor spatial queries. Uh, the first one is rent query. Given an indoor point P, uh, a set of uh, indoor objects, a distance value R, a rent query returns all indoor uh, objects whose indoor distance from P is within R. Then K nearest neighbor query uh, is similar with rent query. It returns uh, K indoor objects whose indoor distances from P are the smallest. Then shortest path query given a source point P, a target point Q, a shortest path query returns the shortest path from P to Q. And a shortest distance query returns the shortest distance uh, from P to Q. Then we talk about uh, indoor model and indexes. The first one is ID model. It's a kind of a, a graph-based model. Each vertex represents a partition, like a room or a hallway. Uh, then uh, each edge represents a door. And there are two functions. The one returns door to partition distance, and the other one returns uh, door to door distance. The next one is ID index. It's a kind of matrix based index. It contains two metrics. Uh, the first one is distance matrix. It, uh, it stores all door to door distance. And uh, the other one is distance index matrix, which is to help uh, uh, speed up finding distance of uh, uh, two doors. Then C index. It contains three layers. Uh, the first one is geometric layer. It is a kind of a R star tree. Then uh, topological layer, it uh, stores topological information of indoor space. Then uh, object layer, uh, maintain object information. This index is mainly for uh, moving object. The next one is indoor partition tree and VIP tree. It's a kind of a, a tree-based index and each node in the tree uh, maintains a distance matrix. The, the difference between IP tree and VIP tree uh, is VIP tree stores more information in, in its uh, uh, distance matrix. Then we compile the features and analyze the uh, complexity and the extensibility. Uh, we compile whether they need to pre-compute. Uh, we can see uh, ID index IP tree and VIP tree need to uh, pre-compute to construct uh, the uh, index. And uh, uh, the structure ID model is uh, a kind of a graph-based model. Index, ID index is a kind of a matrix-based uh, index. And the other three uh, 
uh, uh, tree-based index. We also compare the uh, how uh, how they do initialization, uh, the expansion, and uh, whether they uh, provide algorithms for these kind of uh, queries. We also analyze the uh, complexity and the extensibility. If you are in, if you are interested in this part, uh, more information could be found in in our paper. Uh, then we uh, design an in-depth benchmark. Firstly, uh, data size. We use four kind of uh, data size in this in this work. SYN is synthetic data size. Uh, MZB is uh, uh, a building in Monash University. CPH is Copenhagen Airport. Then uh, HSM is a shopping mall in Hangzhou. Uh, we also do a design a performance evaluation procedure. And we mainly evaluate uh, uh, two aspects. The first one is model construction and the metrics for each uh, uh, model or index size and construction time. Uh, then another one is uh, uh, query processing. The metrics are running time, memory use, and the number of visited doors. It is mainly uh, the last one is only for SPQ uh, and SDQ. Then we uh, vary different uh, parameters to test uh, their uh, performance. Here is the overall evaluation settings. Then we uh, report the results and summarize the pros and the cons of all techniques. Here is the summary of findings. ID model includes uh, minimum space and time uh, time cost in, in construction. And it uh, performs well for range query and uh, KNN query. Um, but uh, its performance for SPQ and SDQ is not very good. Then ID index, uh, it runs fastest for all queries, but it needs a, a large time uh, to construct offline. Uh, C index uh, is similar with ID model when doing search. Then IP tree and VIP tree, uh, they perform well for SPQ and uh, SDQ. So uh, in short, ID index is preferred for small scale spaces and VIP tree is recommended if routing is the task. ID model is recommended for non-routing queries due to its low construction cost and good balance between storage and uh, query time cost. Okay, uh, all codes uh, data size are open online. If uh, uh, you have any question or you find any issues, feel free to contact me via email. Thank you.